Hello everybody, this is Longview. I just want to go ahead and uh, bring up on how you can go ahead and change your l your U limit on non system D distributions. This might not be the same for everybody, but <clears throat> I'm using what uh, what I found to be the most useful guide. I'll go ahead and post a link on where I found that information. But for now, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to do it. So. Usually when you go ahead and download a distro, if you're not using a distro that's especially made for like gaming or stuff like that, your U limit is usually going to be under 5,000. So how you check your U limit is you go ahead and do on your, go ahead and pull up a term, terminal and over here you're going to go ahead and type in U limit dash capital H N. And it goes ahead and tells you what your U limit is. This is usually going to be the number on systems that doesn't offer this for you. I know Pop OS already has your U limit set to over 500,000 to where we need it to be to enable eSync. But for now, I'm actually going to show you how to. I'm going to show you how to go ahead and have that enabled. So, how to do that? Go ahead and pull up your tech. Go ahead and pull up your text editor. Go sudo vim. And what you're gonna do next is go to root etc limits. Enter. Go ahead and put in your password. In here, you're going to go ahead and type in. You're going to go ahead and press I to go in, and then you're going to go ahead and type in your username, and then type in N524288. After that, you're going to go ahead and escape. You're going to write this, right quit, leave. All right, so now that is set. Your ETC limits is now set to that. Now there's one more thing you need to do you have to go into your security limits conf. So for this one, you're going to do sudo text editor. You're going to go root etc security limits dot conf uh, limits dot conf <clears throat> and now that you're in here, you are going to go all the way down. You're going to go ahead and type in I, make a new line, go up here. You're going to do your username. You're going to do hard, no file, and 524288. And here you're going to go ahead and do the same thing again, except you're going to go soft, no file, 524288. The only difference here is you're going to put an at symbol, go ahead and do your username. Hard, you're pretty much just doing the same thing four times, or you're doing the same thing as you did for the previous two. <clears throat> just with the just with the add symbol. Mm. I just like mine spaced out like that. All right. So now that we have that, we are going to escape here. You're going to write and quit. All right, so now that we go ahead and cleared and saved all of that, now we have to go ahead and reboot the system to make sure the effects change take place. All right, so I'll go ahead and get back to you <clears throat> momentarily. All right, so now that we're back, we are going to find out what our U limit is. You go ahead, you went ahead and reboot so the changes could take effect. And here it is. Now our U limit is set at 524,288. 
and you can freely enable async all you want. All right, <clears throat> so that's a good so that's a good video, and I'll go ahead and see you in the next one. All right, have a good one, everybody.